How's it going guys? Welcome back to Kindergarten 2. One thing that occurred to me while I was thinking back on it is that when I had to go through this whole distraction storyline, one thing that was happening during that was freeing up this Monster Mon card. Oh damn, I can't actually get to it. I guess I need a different distraction. One that takes place like in front of this shelf because I was, I was just going to snag that and then restart. Uh-huh. Well, all right, I guess I'm not doing that right now. Based on an achievement that I saw, you need 10 Monstermon cards to have a full deck so that you can actually start playing this game within the game. I only have three right now. That would have made four, so I was trying to, like, quickly flesh out my numbers there a little bit. I think... I, I just... I have a feeling that most people are going to go for a Tale of Two Janitors, like, right away. So I'm going to steer away from that. I could do it to get towards what I think is a Nugget storyline. I think that might be what that is. Again, something that I think people are similarly going to go for first. So I'm trying to, like, mix it up a wee little bit. I instead think I'm going to do Flowers for Diana and then whatever this one is. Because I have, I have no clue what that's going to be. I don't even know. We'll get through them all eventually, I'm thinking, so I'm just picking, picking an order. Simple enough sounding start for this one, I just have to talk to Dr. Danner at the beginning of the day here. So what's up, dude? You gonna explain to me why you're not outlined the way other characters are? Ah, one of the new... specimens. Not that we'll be seeing much of each other. And why not? I don't let below average students into my classroom for morning time. I am not below average. Allow me to prove it. Oh, really? Then perhaps you'd be willing to prove it. Yes, absolutely. That's what I'm that's what I'm laying down on the table right now. Here's the deal. If you can bring me five different types of flowers, I'll let you into my morning time class. Into the morning time class? How the heck am I going to get there that quickly? Like the next thing I think is is morning time. I all right, why, why do you want flowers? Plants have a wonderful biology to them. It's actually kind of true. My, like, career, because YouTube is pretty much a hobby, is doing, like, botanical stuff. I'm not a botanist. I'm, like, a biologist first, but I typically do a lot of botany. So many possibilities for medicine and energy. I don't really do that. I just look at how they grow in different soils and stuff like that. And poisons and neurotoxins and monster enhancing. You're kind of informing a lot right there, because you kind of have to have monsters to enhance them. <clears throat> Just get the flowers, okay? Fine. I won't read any further into it. Excellent! Don't disappoint me. If you don't complete the collection, it would be better if you don't show up in my science class at all. Maybe maybe he still just means the one after recess. I'm not sure. Why is that? I do. I want you to elaborate further. Because if you don't get all the specimens, I'll switch today's lessons from plants to something that involves a nasty dissection. Got it? Based on last time, he was kind of willing to dissect the cadavers of little children, so I'm guessing he would mean me. Where can I find them? Your thought process is so simple. Females tend to like flowers. Oh, speaking of simple thought processes, expand your mind, dude. I know you think it must be big simply because you're brain is big, but that's all just thick-headed skull, hey? Any other ideas? One specimen grows in the garden by the handicap ramp, another by the dumpster behind the school, that's the only one I know. There's one in a vase in the teacher's lounge, and the rarest flower isn't even at this school. You have to get some love-struck loser to deliver it. <laughs> You'll never be allowed in my class! So what are you waiting for? Go! Go on your futile errand, and hopefully this is the last we'll see of each other today. I think his morning class just means the one we attended last time. Even though it takes place after lunch, which in my mind, by definition, means that it is afternoon, not morning. You're the one with the big lab and the big brain, okay? So I won't argue it with you. Oh, a word to the wise. You may want to have a chat with the hall monitors before the day gets started. They tend to give people trouble when collecting my flowers. And where are they? Because I don't actually know if any of them are hanging out in this area. I saw them chatting inside the top of the staircase. So you'll let me in to talk to them? Of course not. Only disabled students are allowed in the school early. And even if you snuck in, the lunch lady would stop you. Now figure out something. I have the start of some ideas here, but like, not really. This feels like a dauntingly large task with a lot of hurdles set out in front of it for being like one of the first missions in the game. Help! Nugget is trapped! How did you get down there? What do you want me to do about it? 
Uh, what did I ask last time? I literally went and double checked. I'm trying not to repeat things too much. I asked what he want me to do, so how did you get down there? Nugget was searching for a suitable place for a new Nugget cave. So you crawled through a sewer grate? No! Nugget was searching for a suitable place to big by the tree next to the handicap ramp. The ground started to shake. There was a cave in. You're handicapped. People seem to think so. Right. So what should I do? Find help. Ask teacher or janitor or principal. Nugget does not care. Just get Nugget out of here. Okay, okay. I wonder if you can actually rescue him and have him not have to remove his own arm. I don't know what the janitor or the teacher would do, but I do know that talking to the principal, I can get the lunch lady out here, which means, like, this is all dialogue we've been through before, which means that I kind of have her out of the way. Now I just have to figure out how to go Monty's direction. Maybe I, maybe I talk to the big new janitor. Hey there, kiddo. I'm your friendly school janitor. Friendly? I don't know how to equate that with a janitor. Yeah, I'd like to think so. You just let me know if you need any help getting adjusted here. I'm always happy to help. Can I get by? I'm sorry, little buddy. Only kids with disabilities are allowed to use the handicap ramp on the side of the school. That's right, handicap. It's my new patented handicap ramp invention. The handicap for all your accessibility needs. Alrighty then, Monty. You willing to, like, slip me in here? I need to get to the ramp. I see. Well, maybe we can work something out. Like what? I'll tell Bob over there that you're pushing me up the ramp for three dollars. Sound good? Best money I ever spent? Pleasure doing business with you. It always is, Monty. Hey, I need that kid I was just chatting with to push me up the ramp. I hope I'm not going like an apple too soon. Oh, all right then. Go on by. <laughs> he proceeds to just wheel himself out of there. You're not really going to fool anyone when you just take off like that, dude. This is a blue flower. I guess I'm taking it. Uh, but what, 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 what more do you have to say, Monty? I don't actually need your help to get up the ramp. Just go do what you gotta do. Proceed to do what I gotta do, then. Well, what do we have here? A giant hole. This is where Nugget probably fell in. And we have a sign with arrows in it. They point up, left, up, right, up, right, left, up. Is that like the Konami code? Wait, is this something I should be doing right now? Up, left, up, right, up, right, left, up. Hmm, there's something just next to it, too. Oh, my. <laughs> I don't think this had anything... Oh! Okay. Uh, what did it start with? Okay, up, left, up, right, up, right, left. And then up should be the final one. It's probably just like a Monstermon card or something. Nice! And I got the legendary sword. Ah, uh, I'm gonna crush noobs with this thing. Deals six damage. It deals extra damage when wielded by someone who has never been hurt in their entire life. That sounds like me. I'm a, a, a mental brick wall of unhurtable prowess. I specifically did all this to get into the school, so I guess I'm leaving behind the the nugget cave, the nugget hole, all so I can slip into here and try to remember where the hell the teacher's lounge is or would be. I didn't talk to the monitors. Uh, we're all that stands between chaos and order. Do you understand? Yeah, bro. I got it. It's all monitoring. It's not a big deal. Not that big of a deal. You're not gonna take- if you're not gonna take this ser- <gasps> Student! Student in the halls before the bell! Study hall! Study hall! Jeez, you really are a little spaz, aren't you? This is your chance to prove yourself, rookie! Take this kid to the principal's office! Fine, I'll take care of it. Go monitor downstairs or something. I was told that I should try and make sure I made contact with these guys. I'm pretty sure this is what I was trying to do. I- I had it in my mind there was another flower up here, but I don't think so anymore. Look, man. I don't really care that you're up here. That little dweeb can fall down those stairs for all I care. He seems a little uptight. No kidding. Just stick it to the little jerk. Why don't you why don't you take this? It's good through morning time. He can't do much to you while you're carrying it. 
Thanks, new outfit. Ah, I can give myself a nice zitty face. Now let's get you back down, uh, back outside. Come on, dude. Don't come back in or Stevie will totally flip. Sure thing. Aw, uh, never mind. Just head on down to class. Get a move on. I don't know if I could have done that any sooner. I didn't really have any conversations with any of the girls. So I figured out a few small things, like how to get into the school and all that, but I don't think I really got much closer with the flower situation. I was wondering what Ted would do when I don't have like a plan in motion. He just goes to play with the car. Bugs, what you thinking, dude? What do you want? I'm busy trying to figure out how to get my knife back. Probably better if you don't have it, so I keep my distance. I just love this doll. She's so pretty, just like me. Do you have any flowers? Of course I do. I have a pretty pink one. But you already know I have that reserved for my new boyfriend. Who's your new boyfriend? Well, we aren't official yet, but it's gonna be that cute boy in the blue shirt and red tie. He's in the upstairs class. I want you to take it to him. Oh, so he's, she's going after Felix, going after the, the brains of the outfit. What is it? It's a love letter. Now go give it to him. How do I get upstairs? I think I know that I can just go out and do it, but I used to hang out with that hall monitor before school started. He would give me passes. I suppose you could try that, but school already started. Interesting. The letter is certainly not a flower, so I feel like I'm still a step away from actually achieving that. Uh, what? What do you want? Never, never mind. I'm confident it can wait. I have my pass, can I just leave? Oh, dope, yeah, that legitimately works. I'm responsible, here's the pass. I didn't give you a, you know what, go ahead. I don't think a jury would convict me over that. It's, uh, awful that you kind of have to think through those sorts of things, don't you? Hold up, new kid. You're only allowed to use, this ba use the bathroom, nothing else. I have a pass. Well, I'm really burning through my apples, though. What? How'd you get one of those? I won't accept. But I kind of have to. So I'm allowed upstairs. Yes. Now go. Goodbye, sucker. I mean, Stevie. I kind of got stuck on the stairs on the way up. <laughs> I bet using that pass really annoyed the jerk, didn't it? You bet. Let's break into someone's locker and see if they're just like hoarding flowers. It seems like not the case. So I, I just got to find my way to the the genius class. What about this outlet? Can I stick forks in this? What about this bathroom? Huh. Turns out I am allowed in. What is this BS? I want a couch in my bathroom. The legends are true. There is a couch in the girls' bathroom. There's a Monstermon card between the cushions. Sweet. We got the chair of spikes. Sounds uh, inviting. Deals four damage, reduce any Monstermon's damage by one. Still more comfortable than most chairs in school. I just realized I should be uh, building my deck a little bit. I, I kind of have a little bit of a balance right now. If I find like another blue one, a couple more of the other colors, I, I kind of have an even spread of the different color types, which I assume will be a useful thing. It's just a bunch of garbage. That's about what I expected. I honestly expected more. Oh gosh, I didn't see you there. This is the girls' bathroom. You're not supposed to be in here. You look a little red there, chief. Uh, well, uh, yeah, you see? I saw this beautiful woman. She had lovely brown hair, a beautiful purple dress, and huge... You mean Mrs. Applegate? Is that her name? Wow. Miss Applegate. I just wish I knew how to get her attention. Why not get her flowers? You think she would like that? Yeah, yeah, I'll get her flowers. Thanks for the tip, kid. If I leave now, I can get back in time to get them to her at recess. Nice. Did not expect that to be like a interaction that I strictly had to initiate or whatever, that that would lead to flowers, but there we go. This air vent looks like it could be unscrewed. It seems to lead to the science classroom. Which, I know how to get a screwdriver, but that's not until recess, and that was with the uh, the whole storyline with Carla there. Is the science classroom the smart classroom? Principal's office, yes, not what I'm after. So, the science class se seems less... Oh no, there you go. Walked straight in. Hopefully, uh, Dr. Dornemore doesn't care at all. What's up, Felix? I'm just here to slip you, uh, slip you this letter. I have no interest in discussing trivial things with you. 
Oh goodness, I'm flattered, but I must have- it's from Cindy! Oh, that makes much more sense. You had me worried things were about to get awkward. Yeah, good thing it's not awkward. Let's see here. The partner would make me more appealing to potential investors. How awful is Cindy? Oh, she's not bad. You're gonna love her. Real sweet gal. Excellent. Then I will accept her request. We will dine together. Good. Here for your trouble, messenger boy. Ta-ta. Thanks? He just paid me three bucks. Say, I haven't seen you around here before. Why aren't you in this class? I'm, uh, I'm working on that one. A man of ambition. I like that. Dr. Danner loves his plants. Those red flowers are really hard to come by. I'm curious where you see them. How do I get them? Give. I'd ask some of the adults. See if any of them are smitten with a new faculty member now that there's been additions to the administration here. I'm one ahead of you on that, actually. What are you doing here? You're not gifted in any way. Get. Ah, never mind then. That's the bell. You'll get off easy this time. But don't you dare intrude in my class again. I feel like I had a much more minor offense last time he shot me in the face with a laser beam. I mean, that wasn't extreme either, but the guy seems to overreact often. My word, she is a handful! What's wrong? She wants something vegan! <laughs> I don't know what the devil that even means. Call back to the original game. Neither does she, dude. Well, you have to find me something she'll eat. This is all you're doing anyway. I'll figure something out. Good! Just remember to bring it to me, not her. We're trying to make me look good here. Got it. I do want the flower from her. I thought... I don't know how... I. She'll give it to him eventually. She'll give him the flower and he'll give it to me if I help him. Hopefully, probably. The only food I know how to get right now is from the lunch lady. But maybe these guys would like share their lunch bag? Normally my girlfriend would sit to me. Oh, stupid new kid. Same whining as before. No gum in your hair this time. How are you liking the food? Any flowers? Ah, uh, poor new kid. Already suckered in helping Dr. Danner with his silly plants. So, it's a no. You're so observant. However, there is one in the teacher's lounge. Ooh, suggestions? Stevie's pretty easy to lure away. All I'd have to do is leave without a pass. Are you willing to do that for me? Of course, the right price. How much? Since I'll be getting study hall for this, it'll run you five bucks. I guess I gotta hope there's nothing else I'm gonna have to spend the money on. Excellent! I'll give him the runaround for the rest of lunch. Good luck, kid. I do have to track down... No, at recess is when he was going to grab the flowers, so I don't even need to hit up Bob the janitor yet. Hey, Stevie! What? Uh, uh, hello, Carla! Can I get a pass for the bathroom? No, you can't! You're already used to yours today! Well then, it looks like I'll just have to go inside then! <laughs> hey, come back! It's not recess time yet! Take your job less seriously, dude. No one cares. Ah, shit, I didn't get any food. Uh, <laughs> I'll figure that out, I guess. Got anything, uh, vegan? Oh, yes. I should have seen this coming. You new students are so picky. I can prepare something in the back, but the janitor looks to still be mopping in the area. So you won't get it for me? Patience, child. You wouldn't want me to have a nasty fall. I would. So, we'll wait for the janitor to finish his work. I'll make the food then. How in goodness... Oh, well, I guess it was late enough in this uh, series of interactions that that was uh, as easy as could be. I'm just trying to, like, steal something because I don't have money. It's a box of nuggets. Nugs it. No, he needs it for his cave or whatever. Shit, I hope I didn't just get busted doing that. Nope, that seems unrelated. Shit, maybe I did still get busted doing it. Uh... Damn, damn, damn. Ooh. I was not expecting to find a Monster Mon card, though. The Mystical Tomato deals one damage and reflect a blue Monster Mon. The key ingredient in Mystical Ketchup. Nice. Really fleshing out my deck, but now I'm kind of stuck back here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I can't get away. She's going to kill me. You've returned for your picky food. I guess I have to find out at the very least what it is, right? There you are, child. Please enjoy your rabbit food. Oh, so I don't have to steal it. That is very specifically for for Nugget. And it, it was for free. It was free food, so I, I don't have to worry about it. I could restart lunchtime, and I should be alright. So I'll, I'll start by initiating the the vegan thing. 
She won't go and do it until the next block when uh, he's ready. You can go lead away. I already forget the character's name. Stevie. All right, so Stevie's out of here. Vegan food is on the way. I honestly just have to figure out how the hell I'm going to spend this next block I have at the moment. There! Flores try! What more could they possibly want from me? Good point. You done, you done good, janitor. I have never seen you work this hard before. Oh, Penny! I never asked you about flowers, actually. I love making new friends. They don't seem too thrilled to meet you. Wow, we're just gonna leave that hanging, hey? That was a chance. That was our chance to figure out what to do with the flowers, and we're just gonna let it drop. Well, well, well. Look who it is. Seems that Stevie's slipping in his duties. Now is my flower collection coming along. Have you found any yet? I've found one. Oh, really? That's more than I expected. I suppose you are in here to collect the flower in the vase over there. Yes. So be it. Make it quick and get out. I have to check on something outside, and I'll be damned if I let a child stay in the teacher's lounge unsupervised. Got it. I didn't expect him to just let me do it. It's funny to have a picture of a flower immediately above the flower like that. Take the yellow flower. Is he going to kill me? All right, I've entertained your presence long enough. Get out. Okay, sheesh. I really thought he was going to turn around and fucking kill me or something. So that's good. That went better than expected. I have the rabbit food. The just plate of, of salad here. Hand, handing it along. Make sure I give it to Felix. Brilliant. Excellent work, errand boy. No problem. Here you are, darling. A nice vegan meal for you. Ah, oh, thanks, sweetie. You're the best. Now you just need to do one more thing for me at recess and we'll be official. Oh my god. Can't wait, honeysuckle. Leave before they start making out. Damn, that was the last step. Okay. The battle has run. Be gone from my cafeteria. Anyone who has disobeyed our lovely principal today shall report to study hall. All others may go play at recess. Oh shit, I can get study hall, I'm assuming. Like, there was the... Uh, gym and the science lab to make it to. I didn't realize study hall was a real thing I could get sent to, so I should tr try at some point. Presumably for one story it'll be necessary. Thank goodness you're here. She is being absolutely wicked. What now? She's insisting that I do something horrible to one of the other girls, but I'm not much for getting my hands dirty. So you want me to do it? Of course. Cindy already told me that you want that flower for Dr. Danner. It's as good as yours if you destroy Penny's self-esteem. How do I do that? She has quite the eye for contraband. I say you take this and plant it by the tree with the beehive. And this is? Not really sure. All I know is that it was in a safe in our summer home. Father probably doesn't want it found. So, put it by the tree. Yes! Once you plant it, I'll let her know it's there. When she's under the tree, shake it until the hive falls. The bees will sting her, and she'll look awful. Just like Cindy wants. Oh, so the baggie doesn't really seem to have much of anything to do with anything. I mean, I, I have to place it, I guess, but I don't entirely see how that builds up to anything. Good day, Penny. Hi, Felix. It is a good day, isn't it? The sun is shining in the... Yes, yes, cut the chit-chat. I heard a nasty rumor that one of those nasty new children has hidden some contraband by the big tree. Oh, no. I'll look for it right away. I thought we were trying to set her up to make it look like it was her contraband. I guess not the case. Oh my, there certainly is some contraband around here. I just need to find it. There certainly is. I, I have my first clue. You're a hell of a detective because I don't know what you possibly could have seen. Shake the tree. Oh, thank God they went after her. Ow! Oh, it hurts. Help me. Help me, mommy, please. That is absolutely awful. Oh, and she opened the gate without me having to use an action to open the gate. Bloody good show! Cindy will be quite pleased! I'm happy you're happy. Flower, please? Music to my ears! Those bees did a great job on that awful girl's face! Can I have the flower now? Of course! A deal's a deal! Thanks for hooking me up with this walking gold mine! I'm sure we'll be very happy together! You two deserve each other! Oh, would you look at that! The little snitch didn't take the, uh, contraband! Well, I wouldn't mind if you want to keep it! Perhaps you could find another use for it. Like what? Got any suggestions? Well, I've seen Father's Associates sell large quantities. Perhaps there's a buyer nearby. Sure, sure. Oh, he's delivering the flowers. Yes, look how nervous he looks. Uh, 
Mrs. Applegate? Huh? Oh, it's you, the new janitor. What do you want? These, uh, these are for you. You got me flowers? Why, that's the sweetest thing anyone's ever done for me that didn't involve pills. Come with me. But what about the flowers? Leave them. Ha 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 ha, genius. Bouquet of flowers, take a red flower. I'm one flower away. And then I could potentially just like sell the the contraband still. I don't know if I'll need the money or what. It's, uh, it's a flower that I choose to take. Oh, I hope Monty didn't like leave or anything. I'm also just gonna check, see if there's any like s obvious or not so obvious spots that like a Monstermon card might be hidden. Not that I'm seeing, not immediately at least. You know what, Monty? I want to sell something. Uh, this stuff. <laughs> Where did you get that? <laughs> oh, jeez, kid. Whatever you're doing, you're in way over your head. Do you want it or not? <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. How's five bucks sound? Deal. I don't really give a shit what you're doing business with, yeah? I am curious to know what it might actually be worth within the game, like if you can get more than that. But for this one time, whatever, I'll, I'll just take what he's willing to give me. That's the bell! Now uh, let's all go back inside, no stalling! Anyone who wants to pay the lab fee- see, that's the thing I was worried about. Is that I would still have to pay the fee? Because I thought, in, originally when I started the quest, that the flowers would be my ticket in. Not the case, I do still have to pay to get in, so that's fine. We're crushing this quest. This quest is so much easier than the last one, or I just am back in the groove of how this game works, maybe? Welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about plants. Please observe the common plant. Right, this whole boring thing about telling us about how we need to look at plants and things. I almost forgot. One of you was supposed to get me some flowers today. Did you manage to get them all? I fucking sure did. You did? Well, that's most impressive. I didn't think a lovely student such as yourself could manage it. So do I get an A? We'll see. I'll be right back. Uh, oh great, okay. I was like, is anything else actually gonna happen here? <laughs> Maybe I just embarrassed his frail ego and he just ran away and wasn't coming back? What the hell is that? PTA said you can't do stuff like this anymore. Oh, all of you shut up. This new student has actually managed to get all the specimens needed to allow Diana to grow, and there's no way the PTA will stop me. Got it, Ozzy? I got it. Now, we're going to be feeding her the flowers in a very particular order. Where did I leave those notes? Damn! I left them downstairs. I'll be back momentarily. Momentarily. Feel free to observe the boring plant while I run out and grab them. What about the less boring one? How did you discover the order? What? Oh, it just came to me while I was gazing around the room. I'll be back with it shortly. Don't touch anything. I was starting to wonder, because I'm seeing that there's the three colored fishes, the three colored bottles, the three colored vials. Oh, and it totally makes sense. So, blue, yellow, purple, and then it carries back on here, yellow, purple, red, red, green. So it's blue, yellow, purple, red, green. That's... Easy as can be. I'm a genius. Yo, classmates, wanna see how a genius is made? This is this is how it happens. This is Dr. Danner's plant creature. It's supposed to be fed the flowers I've collected. Blue flower. He's all good. What should I feed it next? Yellow. <laughs> I feel like I'm some version of the like count. The account from Sesame Street, but I'm all about colors. Just reading out colors to people. Red! And finally, green! I found my notes! We can now begin! My word. She's absolutely radiant! Did you actually feed her the flowers in the right order? I guess so. I'm stunned. I never would have expected such ability from a simpleton such as yourself. Thanks. I th think... But, like, probably not really? Ooh, new Monstermon! I suppose you've earned an A-plus for the day! You're welcome to join my advanced class for morning time tomorrow. You're also welcome to have this silly card from that game you play. I'm touched. Oh, do you know what? I'm restarting. Strictly, strictly for one reason. 
for the sole purpose of feeding it flowers in the wrong order just to see what happens. That's about what I expected. The plant creature wants the flowers in a different order. I guess you could just trial and error this, but it would be a, a pain in the ass. Nice, uh, nice thumbnail potential of being eaten by a plant, you know? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that was the main motivation there. Plus, it's just funny to, like, discover the deaths. This storyline took me half the time of the other one. I, I can't even explain why. I found my notes, we can begin! Oh, it's a radiant, you've done it, I'm stunned. You, you get an A, I suppose. Dope! Well, there's the bell, I'll be seeing you tomorrow for morning time. I guess you will. So long. Oh, it makes it seem like such a, a caring principal. What a nice, a nice lady. She, she really cares about us. <laughs> New item unlocked, an A+. And flowers for Diane has been uh, completed. New clothing, monitor sash, four Monstermon cards. So we're legit getting decently close to that. That's pretty good. Again, times two. So, like, that actually is changing as I'm advancing the storyline in increasing amounts. Deals 2 damage, reduces blue monster mon damage by 3. Only known species of plant to actually hunt down its prey. The monstrous fly trap. Now we're ending up with kind of a, a disproportionate amount of greens. I didn't realize there was two other colors of cards, so on that scale overall, we, we really don't have a ton. And now... Kane's not able, which that's very clever. Start the mission by showing Felix the prestigious pin, which immediately is supposed to make me trustworthy. So the next storyline might be me trying to help Felix kill Ted. And I'm going to try it, and I'm going to see if it advances me to Wednesday. I, I, I don't know. I might be totally off base with that. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I guess episode lengths of this are going to be widely variable. <laughs> I'll see you all again soon.